Police say a juvenile broke into the clinic early yesterday morning and destroyed thousands of dollars worth of equipment. Ray Brewer joins us live this morning in Claremont. And Ray, police say this is not the first time that the clinic has been targeted, right? That's correct, Sean. Fairly recently, as a matter of fact, police say that three weeks ago, someone spray painted the word murder on the outside of Planned Parenthood. So now police are investigating whether or not this latest incident is connected to that. Officers stepped up patrols in the area, and early yesterday morning, they saw someone inside the clinic. Police say a juvenile boy used a hatchet to destroy computers, lab equipment, and phone lines, also damaged the plumbing, causing flooding in both the clinic and the restaurant next door. At this point in time, it's difficult to put a price tag on it. It's obviously going to be significant um, uh, thousands and thousands of dollars. Now, authorities are not saying how old the suspect is, only that he is a juvenile, and they're not commenting on what charges he faces. In a statement, Governor Maggie Hassan said, quote, these acts of vandalism are an attack on the fundamental right of women to access health care and should be strongly condemned by all. Planned Parenthood says it's doing everything it can to get the clinic up and running as soon as possible. They say they're also talking to police about whether or not additional security is necessary for patients and staff. Reporting live in Claremont, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.